basic needs being met. Um, that's just rights to education, rights to vote, um, rights that women are able to work, <laughs> rights where you're able to get married to the person of your choice, rights to raise your family in a healthy environment, meaning there is no war that would prohibit you from um, achieving that goal or being raised in that environment that is not contributing to your livelihood so to speak so i believe human rights is the rights that everyone is entitled to to live the best life that they can and unfortunately we live in a society that not everyone have the rights to that not everyone have the luxury to just have their human rights given to them and it's very sad and it's heartbreaking to know that every day there are people around the world that don't have water to drink or live in a society that prohibits them from getting married to someone of their choice or live in a society that cut off their genitals or live in a society where they are not allowed to work as a woman or live in a society where they are not allowed to vote or live in a society where they are not allowed to pursue whatever the dreams are. That is not human right is allowing us to live our life as best as we can so you know let's know that as we are living this world and we have the luxury of, of the basic things that we have let us not forget those who do not have that luxury as well so my prayers and thoughts are around the world to those who are living in a society that is not allowing them to have the rights that it deserve um, make sure that you follow Boss TV um, to get all the latest information about human rights because human rights is everyone's rights and they should not be deprived of it. Human rights are rights inherent by to all human beings um, regardless of your race, your sex, religion, your language, your ethnicity, nationality and so many more. Um, it is your right to liberty, your right to believe, your right to live and your right to die. Human rights is the ability to be treated equally Wherever you're at, no matter where you're at, you're treated the same, you're not discriminated against. You have the same rights as any other person out there. As a human being, you have the right to live, you have the right to walk, you have the right to smile, you have the right to say what you want to say respectfully. Those are your human rights. Um, I think human rights is the right that everybody should be entitled to, like the right to live, the right to education, the right to be treated fairly and equally, you know, regardless of the color of your skin. It's a natural gift from God, first impression, because that begin with nature. First as a human, before you were born, God sent you specifically to your parents, which is your, your mom and your dad. And as a human from the day you were born, you came into the world, you deserve all rights, all limitations for which a human desire. Even when you go to religion perspective, you're going to get that, that human need certain level to give their comfort. So for the right as a human is, is, is wide beyond man perception. If you come from man's side, you need certain things from your parents from the day you were born, which is care, love, concern, and willingness to be there. All of this put together to give you your right from that time as a human. 
But for the society we live, your right go beyond your parent limitation because as a human, the society got to participate to make you feel comfortable for where you are. That's why we have the saying that the environment you live you have a great impact on your life. So for being a hemo, your right is beyond our expectation as a man. My understanding of human rights is basically uh, is an undeniable right, a fundamental right, and I would say God-given right for a person to be what they want to be and to live their life to the fullest extent possible. Now what that means is for me, my understanding is Every man should be respected, every person should be respected for who they are and for what they bring to the table every day. Um, basically, that, that respect that I have for my life and love I have for my life should apply to the next man over. Uh, the amenities I enjoy as a person should also be something that someone can benefit from. So, I don't, I'm not the only one who will benefit from education, for example, or from the right to travel, the right to live a happy and fulfilling life. The next person should be able to live that, life, that same life if they want to and if they choose to. So that's a right that's just, I'd say available to everybody. No matter where you come from, no matter who you are, you have a right to certain fundamental things like life, like you know, death, like freedom, like education, and all those basic rights you have, and especially the right to be uh, to be yourself. You know, the right to express yourself. Self-expression is very key to that. I also believe human rights should apply to everybody, everywhere, you know, no matter where you come from, no matter where you are, you know, society should give a person a chance to live fully because if you're able to live fully and freely, you feel like you can, comp you can contribute better to society because you feel in yourself you're delivering something from a free and beautiful place. You're not there doing it because you're afraid of somebody and you feel retaliation or anything like that. I think that's the problem with a lot of societies outside the Western world, especially, you know, in Africa and countries we come from where people don't get to enjoy the immunities that you enjoy as people first and so you know they're, they're, they're kind of constrained they're kind of like oppressed and I think that kind of impedes and kind of like you know hamper your chances to be who you are and to really you know serve society and deliver and bring something to society every day you know because you're afraid of you know, retaliation you're afraid of persecution and stuff like that so that's my own take on human rights I have to be respected have the right to vote or uh, shouldn't be abused and um, should be taken care of and um, uh, basically um, everybody should be respected and I think that's it.